Hello everyone, it's All Rider here and welcome to another week in toys. Today is Wednesday the 13th of July and uh, I've got a little parcel here. Uh, this is a cheeky little eBay win. So I've got Shattered Glass Blur. Uh, this is another one of the Shattered Glass figures that um, I really wanted to, to pick up but not wanted to pay full price for. He was on sale for like... I think it was like 17.50 if you spent over 60 quid on on pulse i didn't get him at that point but i managed to win him on an ebay auction for uh 18 quid which ain't too bad now it did come with a comic but unfortunately they have uh screwed it up which is a real shame that is a real real shame so yeah uh the, looks like they put a little flower inside basically saying i hope you're 100 satisfied with the service and the item and it's just a bit unfortunate that they decided to like screw this up and maybe they haven't done it intentionally, they just didn't think, but never mind. Uh, at least I have got the figure, which is the main thing for 18 quid, it's a bit of a bargain. And I managed to get the comic as well, so at least I can try and read this now. I've got the first issue now, so that, that's pretty cool. Uh, I might just try and flatten it off, um, put something heavy on it and hopefully that'll flatten it out. But yeah, cool, I've got Shatter Glass Blur. That only leaves me the jet fire now. I'm not going to pay that full price. I'm going to try and pick up all these for discounted costs. So today's Saturday, the 23rd of July. And uh, it's been a crazy few days with stuff being released, hasn't it? Uh, I've got three parcels here that have arrived. I don't know why Pulse have sent two in separate boxes, but, but there we go. Um, but I've got three items. Uh, I've got another couple on the way, or should be on the way. And, oh God, the amount of stuff that's being announced and released is absolutely crazy. Um, if you want to see me talk about that, check out episode 132 of Transformers The Show. I was on it last night. Um, good to catch up with the lads. Uh, shame Andy wasn't there, but I'll, I'll catch up with him soon. But it's a great show. Check it out if you get a chance to watch it. Um, shall we go through these parcels? We might as well. So the first one, this is a Pulse figure. At least I've got a few more boxes to... To put my uh, my sales stuff in, I suppose. Uh, I've been running out. Still don't know why they didn't put these in, in one box, but there we go. So the first one, it's Wave 2 Deluxe. It is Knockout. I was on the fence about uh, a little bit with this one. It's not G1, and predominantly I'm focusing on G1 stuff now. But I do like the character Knockout. I did pick up RC and Bulkhead, so I thought, why the hell not? I thought I'd pick him up. Uh, I'm not sold on Alita yet. Um, I think the Netflix one looks better, in my opinion, especially in robot mode. But I'll see if I see it in person. It might be one that I pick up at TFN. Uh, but there's old Knockout. It looks pretty cool, doesn't it? Yeah, it comes with his stuff, which is good. I think he's a heavy retail of the Jazz Mold from Studio Series 86. Uh, but yeah, picked up him. Knockout. Awesome. Nice to get wave two here. Second parcel. <laughs> And this is again from Pulse, and I don't know why they've set them in separate boxes, but there we are. It's another Wave 2 Deluxe, and you'll probably guess it's not a Lita, it is a Wild Rider. Um, Mr. Shotton has actually opened his, and he's been sending picture, pictures of him, and he's not too impressed, so I'm interested to see what I think of him. Uh, he's shot with the actual combined mode as well, and there, there is no point to these being on the back of the lease. It is too inaccurate, but um, it seems a bit of a waste of a bot. But uh, Wild Rider looks pretty awesome. Looking forward to help opening it up. I'm probably not going to combine him yet. I'm going to wait until I get all the figures in place, so at least at least dead end. Then I might muck about with the combined horse breakdown on the back or, or whatever. Um, but yeah, I have got Wild Rider. It's cool to finally have him. Um, and as I say, Dead End has now been announced, hasn't it? Um, we've now seen pictures of him, at least in his bot mode, uh, no car mode yet. Uh, and the final one is the first parcel that arrived today. It is from Comics and Cocktails. They have started, they, they are probably the most reasonably priced place now. If you're buying a one off figure, if you're buying multiple things, then maybe other retailers work out cheaper with the shipping. Uh, but Comics and Cocktails include the price of shipping within the items, which is cool. Uh, and this was cheaper than everywhere else, if I'm honest. So it's uh, another Studio Series 86 figure, and uh, it is Junkyard. Who looks junk heap? Junk heap. It's junk heap. I think originally it was called junk. This is heavy. Um, but yeah, this is this is junk heap, as in junk heap Dave, which is awesome. Dave's really happy about this. Um, looks great. 
uh, retool of the Retgar mould. I'd like at least one more of these junkions, uh, but for now I think I'm probably going to be playing in bike mode with uh, old Retgar sitting on top of him. I think that's what I'm going to do. I don't want these open boxes on the Studio Series 86, I really don't. But at least they're more sturdy than these stupid legacy ones. Um, so I think the only outstanding Studio Series 86 figure that we we haven't we haven't seen yet. Sorry, there's two of them, isn't there? There's Wheelie and there is RC. So we're due another wave of these, aren't we? We're due another couple of these figures to be announced. I wonder if it will happen today as part of the SDCC. Um, we shall see. But John Keep here is a welcome addition to the collection. I wonder if I put him on the shelf, he'll end up flirting with all the hot rods like Dave does in real life. But well, awesome, great day. I've got another couple of items on the way, but I might leave them until next week. So until next time, I've been Salt Rider, and I'll catch you again really soon.